in this lecture we will see how to work with pda playground or how to simulate our very log or uh, system very log or uvm ports in uh, pda playground okay so open the browser here enter www.edaplayground.com then enter You need a net connection if you want to work with EDA Playground. So here it is showing login. Click on this. Then just click on Google. If you already uh, have some mail ID attached with Google, click on that. You can automatically log into EDA Playground. Okay. So now first. Uh, Click here languages and libraries. If you want to work with the system very log or very log, you have to choose this one. Then it should be none. If you want to work with uh, UVM, you can choose any one version. Okay. Then you have to choose the simulator. Tools and simulators. Down scroll. And if you want to see the waveform, you have to keep a tick mark here. Open EP waveform after run. Then for simulator, click here. Uh, select any one free simulator. All deck I am selecting. Click on this. Now everything fine. Here in this right side uh, uh, window, we have to type the RTL code. Here we have to type test bench code. If there are multi RTL codes, you can click plus and you will get a one more RTL window. Here also you can type one more test bench okay so now i will uh, type simple rtl and do some example test bench here i typed some example rtl code and this is the test bench code this is the two input and gate code in data flow style here i used monitor dollar monitor for a display and I use it repeat and do dollar random in the test bench. So after typing this code, see here you have to click the save button and then click run button. Now we will get the transcript. We won't get the waveform. Even we select to open EP waveform, we won't get the waveform because we have to enter some more code. That is called dump file to get the waveform. So here um, we have to enter one more end, otherwise we will get error. So for this begin, this is the end. For this begin, this is the end. So even we click on open EP wave, if we don't enter dump file, we cannot get waveform, but we can get the transcript. Here we can see timings and the input values and the corresponding output. Okay. So now to get the waveform here before end module, enter initial begin and initial begin. Then say and run. Now we will get error because in be between this beginning we have to enter something. Okay. So that you no need to remember here you will get just copy this one. And paste here. Okay, dollar dump file. Then move to this next line. Okay. Now click here save. So when you click here, you can see star mark. If there is a star mark, it is not saved. Click this. Now star mark gone. So now it is saved. Now click on run. Now here we got transcript and now 
we can get to wave also here you can see so when i click on the wave somewhere here what it is showing so this is a0 b1 what should be the output value zero like that you can click anywhere and you can check the waveform so here you can use a right button left button to zoom plus or minus you can change the radixes okay you can do these things also so this is the process of uh, simulation of very log or system very log uvm by using eda playground and one more thing after checking your transcript and waveform see here you will get one link when you click here uh, you can copy this link okay not this link so here there is no code i removed code but when you simulated code you will get some link here you copy that link and you attach to your mail and later whenever you click that link you will get this code whatever the code you have done na that code you can get or you can send that link to your friend when he or she click that link they will get that code okay so that is another benefit